ready? Well, the tension is palpable as this fight gets underway, and it's gonna be interesting to see how this matchup plays out. Definite striker on one side against another guy who can really do it all. And in those situations, normally the guy that's more well-rounded will be the one that will find success. I wanna see how this plays out. Oh, nice connection with that punch. It's one thing to have an edge in reach. It's another to take advantage. Nicely done. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Just misses there with the left. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the gentleman. And he connects there with a punch, so pretty good striking display by him thus far. He throws everything so straight and so accurate. Big kick lands. Got clipped with the right hand. Watch the jab. Whoa! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh, he might be out. Big powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Big body kick lands. Oh, nice right hand. Nice kick. Oh, beautiful straight right hand. Timely defense there. Huge block for him. All right, so the taller fighter lands a knee, and Daniel Cormier to my right, I can hear him saying, I wish I was a little bit... Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Oh, look at him land another jab there. He's certainly using that weapon effectively here tonight. The most effective weapon in all of boxing, in all of combat sports, is a jab. This young man has a knowledge of using it like no one else. Throwing that jab, no good. Big kick lands. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Beautiful knee. That's a big strike right there. Liver kick. Trying to hammer that big leg. Oh, big left hand there. Five minutes in the books. All right, now we take a look back at some of the highlights. He has had his kicking game going early and often tonight. I mean, on point, right? He knew that this was going to be a way for him to take control of this fight. He's used those kicks to really put him out ahead. And I'm not sure if his opponent has the ability to adjust and stop him from landing these over and over. All right, here we go as our next round gets underway. His strong leg packs so much power that even when he doesn't throw it full throttle, you see he's able to inflict damage. We'll see if he can keep it going here in this He doesn't throw it full power, but even when he faints it, he draws out reactions from his opponents because they don't want to get hit with any more of those kicks. It's a sight to behold. Oh, nice connection by him there with the right hand. The right hand is the dominant hand, and you can see how well he throws it. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. It's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Oh, misses with the jab. Lee. 
So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here, and as a result, has really picked up the pace in round two. Oh, really exploiting his reach advantage as he landed the jab there, DC. Ooh, what a punch. Lee gets hit by that leg kick. You may want to start checking some of these. And both guys really throwing with authority. Nice body to try to be over. Just missed with the left there. Oh, buckled him there. Beautiful shot to the body. Oh, just out of range with that right hand. Oh, big roundhouse attempt, but unable to land. Lee gets caught with that punch. Punch. 20 seconds to go round two. Oh, beautiful straight left hand. All right, that's the end of round number two. All right, that horn signifies the end of the round. Let's take us through some replays, champ. And the replays are going to be kicks. That's the story of this fight to this point. He is landing these kicks at will, just driving his shin into his opponent's legs, and it's really starting to slow him down. All right, DC, buckle up. Here we go with our next round. High number of kicks landed in the previous round, and he'll look to keep it going. He'll look to keep winning the fight with his kick. He's throwing high kick, leg kick, body kick. He's even throwing a couple spin kicks in there. This guy is so educated with fighting with his legs. Well, just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. Wow! And he landed the right hand there. Oh, nice connection there with a the punch, DC. Great time to land that punch. I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Wind it up on the right there to no avail. All right, late in the fight now, he needs a finish or he's gonna lose this fight tonight. We'll see if he goes for it. I mean, he's gotta pull out all the stops. There is no more strategy. There is no more time to try to set up a punch. You gotta just start letting everything fly. Well, it's all pace and pressure down the stretch. He is really lighting him up now. Oh, beautiful execution with the knee strike there. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. What do you follow up a beautiful strike like that knee with? We'll see very shortly. Oh, and he lands yet another knee. And sometimes it pays to be the taller. Whoa! Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. job to land the straight punch there. Must be nice to have that kind of reach advantage, DC. I know you can't necessarily relate. Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. It's because he's not committing to his bullet. He throws his jab. He may blow the right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down on the right hand. He really doesn't seem to have the intent on landing it. He's got to be confident that it's going to land, and he's got to really throw his whole entire body into those strikes. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. 
Lee gets caught with that punch. All right, so the fight goes the distance as we await the judges' scorecards, but certainly a dominant striking effort out of that fighter tonight. John, he used his best weapons in order to carry him to a decision, a very clear decision in my opinion. A great performance tonight by this young fighter.